Hello and welcome to Gabbit Media, I'm Grant Abbott and today I'm going to, in the simplest way possible, explain how to take your objects from Blender to a program like Unity. This is a question I get asked a lot and I'm going to be answering questions like where are my textures and what file formats do I need to be using. So first of all, here's my model in Blender. If I go to the shading, and you can see it's shaded very simply, it's just got one single texture that I've painted on. So I'm going to keep this tutorial nice and simple, I will explain about PBRs as well in a moment but for the sake of speed, I'll just show you this. So unfortunately, Unity will not read this texture, so we have to create our texture again in Unity. So let's click on our object and go File Export. Now you can actually bring Blender files straight into Unity, but they're a bit larger, and most of the time, if you're working with other people, you'll be exporting them as either an FBX or an OBJ. When you export as something like an FBX, you get your presets down the side here, just make sure you've got selected objects only, otherwise it will export the whole scene with things like lights and so forth. And just press export. I've actually exported this as an OBJ, so file, export OBJ, because that's what the client wants from me. Once we've done that, we'll go into Unity. So here I am in Unity, and what I'll need to do is drag my OBJ into Unity, and you need to bring in your texture. If you've got PBR materials, you'll need to bring in each of those textures. So the albedo or diffuse, the roughness or shininess. So I'll bring in my color, which is all I have for mine. I'll drag the card dealer model into the scene and you'll notice it doesn't come with any materials. What it does come with is the UV map. So it knows exactly where these details need to go on the object. All I need to do now is make a material in Unity out of this texture. So we right click, create, and then down to material. That creates a new material. I'll call this card dealer material, and I'll drag that onto the card dealer. So you've got the parameters up here. In order to get the color to show up on my model, I need to have my material selected, and then I can drag this into the albedo slot. So albedo is the same as the diffuse. Once you do that, you have the results of the color. Now in my model, I want to bring the smoothness right down so it's completely rough. So smoothness is the opposite of roughness. If you have a PBR material, you'll want to be dragging your metallic map into here, your normal map into here, so that they'll display correctly in your viewport. So that's as simple as I can possibly make it. So of course it can get a bit more complicated than this. There's importing animations, the roughness channel, but for the complete beginner, this should hopefully help you get started. Thanks for watching, and I hope this helps.